Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I wanted to make a short tutorial and show you how to add new thread to spiral project. As you can see, I'm working on a long spiral necklace. This tutorial will come out next, but before that I wanted to make sure I cover the basics. So this is, as you can see, quite a long necklace and you'll end up adding a lot of thread. So I want to quickly show you how to actually do that. Now my thread is finishing. Just to show you what we're doing, I'm gonna do one more row. I'm gonna pick up one core bead, which is the blue here, drop it down, pick up four side beads, one, two, three, four, and then go up the four core beads. Now that's what I'm working on. This is a long spiral necklace that will come out in the next tutorial. So how are we gonna get rid of this short tail and add a new one? So I'm gonna zoom in a bit. What I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna go down the four beads that I just added. And then I'm gonna go up one core bead. And here I want to pull the thread. And now here, see the this four beads, they're going down from where I'm coming out. So I'm gonna take this four beads down. And then here I'm gonna go up one bead in the core bead. See, that's where my thread's coming out of. So same row there. I'm gonna go up one bead. And then here I will find the row that's going down. It's this one. I'm gonna go two beads. Here I'm gonna make one knot. I'm just gonna take my needle through the between those beads leave a small tail, a short tail, a short loop, take my needle through and pull it. So I have one knot. Take it all the way down. And now here, I'm gonna take my needle downwards as far as I can. Just going through those core beads. Don't have to go too far, it's just, a bit further from the notch you made so you know your thread's not gonna come apart and then here I can remove my needle and cut the thread at the very base that's how you get rid of the tail and I'm gonna thread my needle with new thread And now before I add it, I want to make sure I stretch my Naimo first. So I remove that curl. And now we're gonna add the same way we got rid of the tail, but in the opposite direction. So I'm just gonna take my uh, thread, let's say here through the core beads Let's say I came out of here, three core beads, pull my thread. By the way, you if you are struggling with your needle, switch to smaller size. That's what I usually do. I work with a size 10, but when I have to get rid of the tail or around the clasp, I switch to size 12 because it's gonna be easier. And now here, I'm gonna leave a short tail that I can hold on to. And now I'm coming out here, so I'm gonna go up the rows of side beads that goes up there where I'm exactly coming out of. Just gonna go two beads. I'm gonna make a small knot here between those two beads. Just gonna pull my thread, leave a short loop, take my needle through. And when I tighten the knot, I wanna make sure it goes between those two beads. And take it up. And now I'm gonna find the core bead right next to it. I'm gonna go downwards one bead. And then I'm gonna find the row that's going upwards at the same place and go up those beads. And then here I'm gonna go down one bead. Like 
might be a bit tight, but you can do it. Just make sure it's the bead right next to where your thread's coming out of. Not one up or not one below. And take my needle through. Now I'm just gonna directly make my way up. I'm gonna go through these four beads that that's where my thread's coming out of. So that's right neighbor next to it, go up. And then I'm just gonna go through all those core beads to the top. Now I can go ahead and get rid of the tail, just cut it at the very base. Pick up my project, pick up one core bead, drop it down. I'm working on just a spiral rope. Pick up four side beads and then go up four core beads. And pull the thread. And you just continue like nothing happened. You don't have any extra tails, you just have a long thread to continue working on. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. I hope it was something new for you. And I'll see you in the next one. In the next one, we'll work on actual spiral rope. Bye-bye.